हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सॉल्व दिस साइंस मैथ ओलंपेडल जबरा प्रॉब्लम सो हियर वी हैव एम स्क्वायर इक्वल्स टू एन प्लस नाइनटी सिक्स एंड एन स्क्वायर इक्वल्स टू एम प्लस नाइनटी सिक्स एंड वी सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फॉर द डिस्टिंक वैल्यूज ऑफ एम एंड एन बिकॉज हियर यू सी दैट एम इज नॉट इक्वल्स टू एम इट्स मीन्स दैट वी फाइंड द डिस्टिंक वैल्यूज ऑफ एम सो हेयर द वेरी फर्स्ट स्टेप वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज फर्स्ट वी विल कॉल दिस इज आवर इक्वे नंबर वन एंड वी कॉल दिस इज आवर इक्वे नंबर टू uh and now here in the next step uh, we first uh, subtract equation number 1 with equation number 2 uh, so when we subtract these equations it will be written as m square minus n square equals to n plus 96 minus m minus 96 Uh, and now here further uh, we can apply the square identity in the left hand side so m square minus n square equals to m minus n times of m plus n then here we move this n and m in the left hand side so this m uh, in the left hand side becomes positive m this positive n becomes negative n and it is equals to this plus 96 and minus 96 are cancelled out by each other and we get it is equals to 0 So here you see that uh, we need to take common m minus n and the remaining terms are m plus n and plus one equals to zero. So now here we need to break this equation into the two cases so that the first case is we take m minus n equals to zero and the second case is we take m plus n plus one equals to zero. So in this case, uh, here we easily get m equals to n, but in the start of the problem, we will take m is not equals to n. So uh, we reject this case because uh, we will solve this problem for distinct values of m. So that now uh, here uh, from this case, uh, we will move uh, m and one to the right hand side, and we get our n equals to minus one minus m. we call this is equation number 3 and here we copy down equation number 2 so that equation number 2 implies that m square equals to n plus 96 so we substitute this value of n here uh, and this equation is written as m square equals to n and the value of n is minus 1 minus m and this is plus 96 So here we move all of the terms from right hand side to the left hand side so it will becomes m square and this is minus m becomes plus m and this is minus 1 plus 96 equals to 95 so when we move plus 95 in the left hand side it will becomes minus 95 and this whole equation equals to 0 So here you see that this equation will becomes quadratic in m variable so here we can apply the quadratic formula in order to solve this quadratic equation so that first we can write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a equals to 1 b equals to 1 and c equals to minus 95 So here uh, we can apply the quadratic formula. It is stated as m equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus four times of a c divided by two times of a. So here we can put the values of a, b, and c, and it will be written as m equals to minus b. The value of b is minus one plus minus square root of b square. b is 1 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is minus 95 and it is divided by 2 times of a so here our a is also equals to 1 so that here we need more simplification and it will be written as m equals to minus 1 plus minus square root of 1 square equals to 1 and this is minus times of minus becomes plus And four times of ninety-five equals to three hundred and eighty, and it is divided by two. So here further, uh, we rewrite uh, the above equation as m equals to minus one plus minus. Here we get one uh, plus three hundred eighty equals to three hundred and eighty-one divided by two. So these are the uh, two values of m. 
and now here from these two values of m we will find the corresponding values of n so first we uh, break these values here we write the positive value it is 1 plus 381 divided by 2 and here we write the negative value it is minus 1 minus square root of 381 divided by 2 so we need equation number 3 here so equation number 3 is implies that we copy down this equation here n equals to minus 1 minus m similarly in this case uh, we will copy down equation number 3 it is n equals to minus 1 minus m so now first we uh, substitute the value of uh, this m here and it will be written as n equals to minus 1 minus m the value of m is minus 1 plus square root of 381 divided by 2 here we need to take the lcm of this term so the lcm is 2 and we obtain 2 times of minus 1 equals to minus 2 and this 2 is cancelled out by this 2 and now we multiply this negative sign on both of these terms it will becomes plus 1 minus 381 square root so we will obtain here n equals to minus 2 plus 1 equals to minus 1 and minus square root of 381 divided by 2 this is the value of n corresponding to the value of m is this one okay so now here similarly we will proceed the second case and now in this case we we can again put the value of uh, this m here and it will be written as n equals to minus 1 minus m the value of m in this case is minus 1 minus square root of 381 divided by 2 so uh, we need to take the lcm of this term again so yeah. its lcm becomes again 2 and we get this is minus 2 and we multiply this negative sign on both of these values it will becomes plus 1 and plus square root of 381 and we get the value of n equals to minus 1 plus minus 2 plus 1 equals to minus 1 and plus this is square root of 381 divided by 2 so this is the value of n corresponding to the value of m is this one okay so finally we have the two roots of the given equation are the first root is m n equals to the value of m is minus 1 plus square root of 381 divided by 2 and the corresponding value of n is minus 1 minus square root of 381 divided by 2 this is the first solution and the second solution is minus 1 minus square root of 381 divided by 2 and minus 1 plus square root of 381 divided by 2 these are the two solution sets of the given equation and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos